somebody is sleeping on my pillow. And by somebody, it's a big fluffy dog. Miss Mango, are you gonna get off my pillow? Anytime now. Hey guys, so I've been wanting to host my own tea party for a while now. I think tea parties are so cute and it's a great way to hang out, have some food, and drink some really good tea. And before I do my first run with my girlfriends, I wanted to do a quick run at home and I decided might as well share it with the dogs. So I'm going to show you guys how I made a cute little puppy tea party. So to start off with, I bought some different desserts at Whole Foods Market. You can bake your own, but I'm not very good at baking so many different types of items, so it's just easier to just buy some at your local grocery store. You can buy macaroons, cookies, cupcakes, scones, all different types of sweets that you can add to your cute little display. I got my display at Target from last year's Easter and it was on sale. In addition to sweet foods, you can try adding some savory foods. So I have some deviled eggs, this is tomato soup, and a few fingered sandwiches. And if you don't know how to make fingered sandwiches, honestly, it's just regular sandwiches cut really, really, really tiny. I think to have a really cute and delicious tea party is to have a good balance between salty foods and sweet foods and just having a really good variety. So this is what one of my little tea stands look like and the other tea stand here as you can see has a lot more sweet items, a few cake balls, some cookies, some tarts, brownies, things like that. If you guys are wondering, the tea I'm drinking is the Tezo Ginger Lee Jasmine Tea. It's really pretty. came in this tin. I think coconut's ready for a tea party. Right, coconut? What about mango? Are you ready for a tea party? So this is what my initial tea party setup looks like. I have a scone in the middle, some tea, and of course the two displays. Of course, if I invite more girls, I'll just have a couple more items in display, and I think it'll be really fun. So let's go ahead and invite the puppies to have a tea party with me. Of course, Mango is not the only one invited. Coconut is just on the other side of the chair as well. So that pretty much completes my first pilot rundown of a cute little puppy tea party. I'm excited to share it with my girlfriends and really fledge it out. I hope you enjoyed this very brief vlog experience. For more videos like these, please subscribe and give us a thumbs up if you haven't already and do check out our social media website so you can get a quick preview as to all of the other things that Mango and Coconut does on a day-to-day -day basis.